looking down at me and he takes off his mask and it's me. I'm the guy behind the mask. That's weird, right? A near-death experience. Good to see you. Reminds me that I'm dead. Can you help me? Look, you chose to play a dangerous game, all right? You lost. You knew the rules. I was confused. Just want you to check these guys out. Make sure they got the cash. You tell them you're working for me. How much are they supposed to have? Trust no one. Trust the money and trust your peace. doing some business with some guys and it didn't go so well and they found out where I lived. Catherine! Catherine! You were doing business? It didn't go so well? What are you saying, Ian? You got her killed? You total bastard! You don't even know, Harsh Man. You don't know. I've known a pain so intolerable that every breath felt like my soul was on fire! I had a business partner. Set me up real good. So, you gonna go after this business partner of yours, or what? Go after? Yeah. What do you mean? You know, payback. Oh, no, man. I'm not that type of guy. <laughs> I believe he'll get his in the end. What, a, what about this? I mean, is it right if I just stand by and watch his bullshit and lies and corruption take over? And I don't say nothing. You know, shouldn't I just stand up and say, hey, you know what? This isn't right. Stop this. You know, shouldn't I do something about it? Shouldn't I? Listen, I have lived my life the best way I possibly can. Now, I've always tried to do what was right. Now, I know you may see me as a complete and total failure, but deep down in my heart, I have done the best I possibly can. Now, what more can I do? To be or not to be, huh? That is the question. There's the rub. The dread of something after death. And in that dream of death, the dreams may come.